one and only Local 10 News starts right now. We begin with breaking news. Shots fired in a cargo area near Miami International Airport, sending two people to the hospital. And that's not the only crime scene tonight. Let's get right to Local 10's Janine Stanwood, live with what we've just learned. Janine. This is a cargo area west of Miami International Airport, all of it unfolding near a loading dock. We're told it actually started with a dispute among co-workers. Commotion and gunfire at the loading docks outside Miami International Airport. Once officers arrived here to right to the cargo area right behind us is when um, they were able to make contact with some of the parties that were involved in the shooting. Police say they got the call after reports that two people were shot after a dispute that started several days ago. Everyone involved, we're told, working here at a freight forwarding company called Cargo Force, a witness in a nearby office hearing the shots. I heard two gunshots. Po, po. Today, this dispute escalated into a physical confrontation amongst four males. Police say a relative rushed the two to the VA in Miami in their own car. We spotted a silver Nissan riddled with bullet holes in the parking lot with officers surrounding it. The two injured were eventually taken to Ryder Trauma. Miami-Dade police say the shooter and another person involved are now being detained for questioning. Police, as you can see, have just cleared the scene, but they are still working. That silver Nissan, we're told, they have taken that in as for evidence. One of the people who was involved has been detained, as well as the shooter. As for those two people injured, one shot in the abdomen, one shot in the leg, we're told both are stable. The investigation continues. We're in West Miami-Dade. I'm Janine Stanwood, Local 10 News.